The International Day of Hope and our community is unveiling a new mural to mark the occasion. Cold Await News Now's John Macaluso joins us live. John, this day is all about bringing hope to Reno. Yeah, Josh, this is the very first International Day of Hope, and it comes after a proclamation by, issued by uh, Mayor Hillary Sheevy in early April. Now, uh, Reno became the very first hopeful city in 2019. This is just a movement to continue to bring hope to our area. Now, taking a look at the mural behind me, this is just a small part of the mural. Sunflowers are the theme, and there are four different murals showcasing the different aspects of hope. Now, the goal is to celebrate hope all over the world and share the science of hope and activate it in our community. Hope is really a vision for something in your future. It can be big or small, and it's um, fueled by positive feelings and inspired actions. So hope is not just a wish. Hope takes feeling good and also taking action towards hope. Getsky, who created Hopeful Cities through the International Foundation of Research and Education, she says hopelessness is the single consistent predictor of suicide and predictive of violence and crime, and we're not really taught how to deal with it. With the Day of Hope today and through Hopeful Cities, she hopes to help the community learn how to activate hope. Now, the unveiling is happening today at 1 p.m. We're at the train station off of East Commercial Row, and uh, the this is going to be unveiled and Mayor Hillary Sheevy will be here as well as some other community leaders. We'll have some more information a little bit later in the morning coming up on ColoTV.com. Yeah, John, as we know, hope can go a long way in making people just feel better. All right, thanks.